This video essay will go over the four signs of symbolism of humanity within accelerators. Now first of all, keep Galorum's appearance in mind. She has one robotic arm and one human arm. This is the link between everything of all the characters and symbolisms of humanity within this video. Now let's talk about Sparky. On the far end of the spectrum, we have the captured drone, Sparky. At first, he is a full-on drone, like Galorum, representing the lack of humanity and doing what he was ordered to do. Robots often follow their orders, just like Sparky was. Sparky's programming is to... Yes! I've got it! Oh, please. Win the races, and any realm that he's in, and... What are your orders? Huh? It thinks you're Galorum. Follow any order that Galorum orders. His robotic form signifies his void of humanity. This is further shown when the drone tries to... much like Galorum later in the series, further reflecting the lack of humanity. However, as most characters in the series, Sparky has character development. As he is integrated more with the drivers, particularly Monkey, he develops... Give me a wrench, Monkey. <laughs> a monkey wrench. <laughs> uh, huh? His name's Sparky. Say hi, Sparky. Hello. Don't need about a parts from that racing drone that got smashed. Yeah, he can help us out around the garage. Here, let me show you. Sparky. Sparky. Hello. Lou Porkchop's motorcycle. Huh? Hello. Huh? huh? Hello. Ah! Run, Sparky! Oh, come on, you little thing. Oh. Hello. Some humanity. Monkey naming the drone Sparky and even interacting with him in the first place signifies and acknowledges the process of Sparky's humanity. This is also symbolized through Sparky taking on, presumably, Monkey's clothes, such as a cap and goggles, human clothes. Sparky is again also similar to Galorum in that he has also one robotic arm, while the other arm has metal maniac parts to it, i.e. human made parts, further showing his development of humanity. Sparky also develops <laughs> Human characteristics, human emotions, and even monkeys' human mannerisms, again showing how human he is becoming. On the other end of the spectrum, Galorum symbolizes the lack of humanity. Robots always signify the lack of humanity in which they either develop or consistently stay inhumane. This is shown through Galorum's resentfulness of the humans, even at the thought of them winning. Not for long. You think you've won, human. The only real victory is survival. Her use of the word human further shows her resentment, almost like it's an intentional term to create a divide between her and her competitors. Her hate for the humans is also justified into killing Vert. <laughs> Let's see what lies under your 
like Alarm's human appearance is evidently more robotic than Kadeem's and Wild's, which will be discussed later, with her final drone form coincidentally mirroring her lack of humanity. Galarm is symbolically the final form of losing your humanity, the lack of it. Keep in mind Galarm also has one robotic arm and one human arm, in which she also coincidentally tortures her captured drivers into developing one robotic arm like her, furthering the theory of Galarm being the lack of humanity, Kadeem being the loss of humanity, Wild being the process of losing your humanity, and Sparky gaining the humanity. This could also show Galarm's loneliness in that she is the only one in a faction to think for herself and wants others like her. Kadeem signifies the loss of humanity. If you haven't already, go watch my previous Kadeem is Gone videos. Basically, Kadeem signifies the loss of humanity because. Kadeem, it's not too late. Come back with us. Kadeem is gone! <laughs> when Kadeem says this, his last remaining piece of humanity can't symbolically hold on to the last remaining human piece of himself, shown through him letting go with his human hand. As soon as Kadeem made the choice to let go, he no longer saw himself as human, and he himself saw the loss of his humanity. Kadeem's appearance also mirrors this altered from human to cyborg, ultimately showing his irreparable body as well as his irreparable humanity. Kadeem symbolizes the loss of humanity. Wild portrays the starting process of losing your humanity. It is evident that Wild is going through the same method of torture as he is Kadeem, with a process that has just started, due to Wild only losing one of his arms. Due to this, Wild's body is also relatively undamaged, but is also... They wanted to know things, Kurt. I don't know if I talked, I can't remember. We'll worry about that when we get back. Ugh. Wait, these speakers, I don't have room. <laughs> Never really liked that Teku music of yours anyway. Nolo, I've got my brother. We gotta use the EDR. You heard him. We're out of here. Hey, thanks for coming after me. We're even now. Brothers don't keep score. His mentality and humanity is damaged, but not broken or lost, much like his body. In fact, both his mentality, humanity, and body are still intact. Wad was on the path to lose his humanity, which was fortunately stopped when his brother came to save him. Wad symbolizes the starting process of losing your humanity. The physical appearances of Sparky, Galorum, Wild, and Kadims mirror their state of humanity. Sparky's process is a reverse to Kadims, Galorums, and Wilds, in that after they are captured, Sparky becomes human while Marky and Kadeem become less human, and that is the symbolism of humanity within Accelerators.